have to do a review for the Deluxe Trunk Bike Carrier by Allen Sports. And it is a two bike rack. And also, the whole reason I wanted to show this is because I think a lot of people are intimidated by the bike racks for their cars, whether it could scratch their cars or whatever. But I literally had no trouble and I just wanna walk you guys through it. And this is a great product by Allen Sports Two Bike Rack Deluxe Trunk Bike Carrier. It can also fit women's bikes. So now we'll show you how to fit your women's bike as long as well as a child carrier that connects to the bike as well. I will show you how to put both of those on. But typically this is for a men's bike. But I made my woman's bike fit just fine. So let me show you. So first you'll get it out. And it'll pop out and it'll have these two poles right here. And these just push into place. These two poles, these silver ones, okay? And it may look intimidating. I swear to God, I have to put myself in the place of when I got this, I was so intimidated by it, but it's gonna be okay. So, you wanna make sure the long part, you see these parts right here? These are the parts that the bike actually stands up on and you're gonna place the bike into these parts right here. Right here and right here and then you actually strap it around and it holds the bikes. So this part goes on the bottom of your trunk and this part goes on the top because it's gonna to wanna to be standing up, see? To hold the bikes up in these places. And then of course it comes with straps that come along the bottom. One strap that comes up here and one strap that goes on each side. Remove the straps. Be careful when you're first setting it on, go slow and gentle because those straps do have little metal plates on them. So you just wanna go slow when you're doing it. Side strap on. I need to find the middle one. This one goes underneath.
I'm going to tighten that one. See, that one goes up there. Go on the side. On the bottom. On the side. Now, here comes the part where you can put the woman's bike on. This bike carrier by Allen Sports. So... <coughs> Put it on the little pegs that I showed you that are facing upright. There's two of them. You're gonna have to have a little bit of strength to lift the bike. Lord knows, like, I don't know, four years ago? I don't think I'd be able to do this. But you just slip it through the grooves. And watch out for the, like, your bike pedals. Because you want to tie those down to make sure they don't hit your car. So that, I just got, I just got a woman's bike on this Allen Sporting one, as you can see. So now, right here, you're going to come. I can't wait till I get my camera stand. Um... You're going to use the pegs right here. You're going to strap in your bike. I mean, it's really cool. It's really not, it's not that scary. You come over here and you do the other side. Okay. Now the only thing you want to make sure, right, is you want to use these extra floppy little straps you see flowing in the wind. So like the side part, right, that I showed you that I put in, tighten the side part but use this strap go over to your pedal and tie your pedal down so your pedal doesn't see tie your pedal down so your pedal doesn't scratch your vehicle that's where people go wrong with these bike racks they don't secure their stuff you just secure the bike in there but it can still move you know the wind and everything else so I'll tie the pedal down. And I just did this for extra precaution. I mean, this isn't anywhere in the user's manual. But most definitely. Um, oh, wow, guys. Holy moly, I just had a moment. Look. It came with an extra front strap. So that's two of them. So I'll add that on there, too. Up top here in a second okay so I'm gonna use the bottom strap to now tie my lower tire in I'm gonna tighten my lower tire my front one that way that way this front tire won't move while I'm driving because this can hit the car. So I'm going to tie this still. Because you don't want that to be banging up against the car. That will scratch your vehicle. So I'm just doing a double knot. That's all. Just making sure it's going to stay still. And I took this out yesterday. With my baby girl. And we had a blast. At the park. We had a blast. And then I'm going to show you guys how you can add in a kid's carrier on top of this by using the second rack. Which is super cool. And it makes it where my kid can come with me. Because she can't go as fast on her own bike. So I'm going to tie this down. Tie anything that can blow in the wind down. Utilize all the extra straps and and leverage that you see. Any roping, any straps, use it. So I'm going to use this first part, and I'm going to put it right where the other bike should go. 
right there on the rack. And then I'm gonna use it. I'm only gonna use one. You could use two, depending on your carrier. I'm gonna tighten it just like I did on the bike. And you definitely wanna tie down the kid's carrier. So I'm gonna use these extra straps and I'm just gonna tie this tight to the bike. Double knot. I don't know what one would do. I don't think it would do anything. <laughs> There's some extra leeway. Double knot her there. And you could always use bungee cords. I've thought about it too. I wish she doesn't flap so much because it'll create wear and tear on her. But there you go. How to put a woman's bike in a kid's carrier with the two deluxe, two bike rack deluxe trunk. Bike Carrier by Allen Sports. Well worth the buy. $66. Goodbye, guys. Peace and love. Everyone take care.